Hello and welcome back to some more Cyberpunk 2077. My name is Hannah, your favorite hydrated gamer. Make sure that you have your water and we're gonna quickly get back into it because we gotta get through some things with this game. <clears throat> um, sorry for the delay. I realized that after the semester ended, I did not properly rest. Like we finished going to school and I just started all of this like recording and um, I didn't give myself a chance to rest. So I kind of crashed and that is what you guys saw um timeline's different because i don't like to say exactly when the semester ended but yeah but anyway before we get into it i was asked some questions a couple videos ago about my law school experience um i was asked by michael simmons 9435 hello um to talk about my law school experience things that surprised you things you wish you knew sooner and or how you adapted to classes so i'll say the things that surprised me um i always heard that law school was very cutthroat and it is but what surprised me is the way that it showed up so i thought when people said law school would be cutthroat i thought it would be blatantly obvious one second hey, do you have a moment need to talk i mean a longer moment can you come by the camp i have a problem on my way yeah thanks that's good to hear. Give me a little more intel. What's your grief? Well, it uh, would be better to- Let me guess. Saul, right? You know me well. Mm-hmm. See you soon. All right, we'll do that after this. Um. So yeah, so what I mean by cut through is like, it's just like, not so much from the people, but just the way that it, shows up i guess it's gonna be different for every school um the grading just how because law school grades are on a curve so just the fact that if you get two more points if you get two more questions right on the test that could drastically change your grade from like a b to an a minus or something like that like it's just the small things matter i guess that's what i learned um that's what surprised me the most is how significant the small things matter another thing that surprised me so i worked in law firms before so it wasn't too much of a culture shock. Uh, I'm just trying to think. Um, is, what else? All of, I don't wanna say the reading surprised me cause I knew you had to brief cases. Um, I think it's just sometimes the volume is, it wasn't a surprise, it was kind of annoying. <laughs> but you have to brief the cases, um, helps you understand the information better. But it still wasn't a surprise. It was just like, oh, um, so yeah. I didn't even see what option popped up. Oh, what the? Oh, I was supposed to knock four times. My bad. My bad, y'all. No, three. Let me check the text. I just picked something. I didn't even see what uh what popped up. uh let me open up oh no no i didn't mean to do that let me open up my phone four times my bad y'all okay yeah so i'll say that's it for now that was surprising um I, I guess the little prep that you get to study in between finals was also surprising um but again nothing that was just like too much to handle um so yeah okay so the next question was things you wish you knew sooner so this one is a personal one i wish that i had learned okay we're gonna because this is where i messed up last time i wish that i knew how okay. i studied a little Come bit better inside. quick i fear that they had to coach you now are you gonna tell me what the fuck you were thinking i used a sedative she tried to enable her tracker. I had no choice. I offered her some tea. You kidnap Hanako Arasaka and offer her a cup of fucking tea? Yes, she respectfully declined. Tell her the truth about Yorinobu. No embellishment. And state your terms clearly. Perhaps to you, she will listen. Of course. Hanako-sama, 
彼女が例の人物ですどうか話を聞いてあげてください You're Nobu's the murderer He strangled your father I saw it with my own eyes You must be mad to think I will listen to such nonsense Thing is I'm damn determined and got nothing to lose Got your prototype relic jammed in my head. By freak coincidence, it stopped, then helped me survive. A bullet. Now it's slowly killing me. One of your personality engrams is overriding itself onto my psyche. And if I don't find a way to stop it, well, it won't end well for me. Hanako-sama, be is living proof of the terrible crime your brother committed. We can confirm every word she speaks if only you will help her with the relic. Hanako sama. Did you hear that? Go and check. A bad feeling about this. I can't even move. On the ground, cut, don't move. Chance to get the fuck out of here. Sakamura, can't leave him back. Forget there. him, guys. Toast. Unless you want to wind up like him. Keep low in I-360. They're in the hallway. My bad, y'all. Reloading. Oh. I can't even see straight for real, for real. Focus. <laughs> oh, I need stronger weapons, bro. This ain't it. It's hard to see because everything is red, bro. And I can't hack through walls. I thought I unlocked the thing where I could do that. Okay, y'all. Oh, right there. I didn't see where that was coming from. Yeah, I need like some armor piercing stuff. Did that get him? That doesn't open. Okay, let's just keep going. What's this? What I need to do is actually hold on y'all. Uh no. 
I need to switch this because this isn't doing, why is my monitor so bright? This isn't doing anything for me. What is this? I guess. I don't really like that one either. I thought I unlocked the thing where I could, you know... Heck. Alright, we're just gonna keep going. Oh. Oh! Oh! I was going the wrong way down the hallway. Oh! Oh, why am I not crying? Oh! You definitely are, sir! I need weapons that can pierce armor and reload faster. I know before, I might have said this before. I know I was like, oh, all I care about is damage. Uh uh. Changing that one real quick. <clears throat> Only having weapons that reload mad slow? This ain't it, child. You're gonna get me taken out. Which I know it's like faster to switch weapons than to reload, but I don't like my other ones. But we don't really have a lot of money to be able to get another weapon right now. Oh. What the Don't you fucking dare float off. Not now. Come on, gotta get the fuck out of the city. Oh, okay. Think they make these motels especially for royal fuck-ups like us? AC's busted, dirty needles under the mattress, shitters clogged. Hmm. No, for real. Who fucking comes here to sleep? That's We're what a I said. miles outside Night City. Someone leaving town just keeps driving. Somebody going there sleeps in the damn city. What good's a motel in the middle of nowhere? I'll tell you who sleeps here. Johnny? Yeah? Shut your gonk mouth. Please. Saying random shit ain't gonna help anyone. How the tables have turned. Johnny, for crying out- Now we're the ones sitting around waiting for Sokka assault squads to storm in. Anyone knocks, blast the fucking door. No warning. Not keen on us ending up like Takamura. Hear that? Car. At this hour, in this place? Fuck. Just one? It's probably Takamura. Finger on the trick, V. I'm not going to pull the trigger. For v. Don't touch that door. I don't have I a choice. Who's there? I said, who's there? Uh, want the whole motel to hear, or will you let me in? I'm armed. Don't try anything. Finally. Ugh. That on the wall, is that blood? Yeah. Knocked the last star off this stuff. So, you were saying, got a message? Sitting right here. Oh, it'll start soon.
What'll start? It's a doll. Or a proxy. <clears throat> I must make one thing clear. I still think you are mad, but... Monaco? That you? But I can fool myself no longer. I believe you. Damn shame you didn't believe me earlier. Goro might have still been alive, had you? If you invoke his name, remember he did everything for this conversation to happen. That demands respect. Fine. Yorinobu planted a tanto in the corporation's very heart. I must act while the wound is fresh, and you will help me. You are living proof of his crime and treason. You're gonna help me first. Perhaps I did not speak clearly. We must act quickly. Well, I'm pretty tight on time too. Dying, in fact. My dead body make for a pretty lame-ass witness. I understand. Want to know everything you know about Mikoshi? Mikoshi? One of my father's flagship projects. A data fortress with servers situated on orbital stations all around Earth. Think of it as an archive of personality constructs. Digitized psyches. Try a prison. A matter of perspective. In any case, that is not where you will find salvation. Not without extensive knowledge of the relic and the construct creation procedure. Track down your runaway. Hellman was hiding under Kang Tao's wing. We chatted. Think sooner or later the engram will completely consume me. The process can't be stopped. A surprisingly deterministic conclusion for a man of science. At the very least, got my hands on the relic schematics. Got detailed information about its inner workings, project tech documentation. All useful. Even more so, given that Hellman is still alive. I will contact him and explain that one does not leave Arasaka by the back door. Managed to make contact with Alt Cunningham. The Cunningham? The very same who invented Soul Killer, using her own modified version now. That should be more than useful. That's about the extent of what we got. What now? Let us meet in person. At Ember's, in the city center. It is discreet. Just remember one thing. From now on, we both must exercise extreme caution. Uh, well, that's my job done. Know what? What? I think I'd have rather had a wave of Sokka meets March in here. Got what we wanted. Don't tell me that proxy got to you. Fuck you. Come on, think about it. Yesterday, Hanukkah was living in a world that was completely safe for her. Now what she got on her hands now? Foreign city, a homicidal brother, and a fucking thief. That's why she sent a proxy. She's alone. And she is shitting herself more than we are. Uh-huh. Clink. What? Did you say clink? Mm-hmm. Sound of her attaching her leash. Okay. We're doing good on time. Let's go to Embers. How much money do we have? We only have $2,000. I gotta find a way to get more money. What's up? Got a few more words about the... the porcelain cunt? Fuck! <laughs> Shit. Get ready. Fuck. Johnny. You ain't dying yet. 
I got you. I don't remember this part. I don't remember. I remember talking to Hanakasama. That smells the sea breeze. But I don't remember. Get up. Pacific's beautiful this time of day. Like this part. I kind of remember the proxy. Almost flatlined by that attack. Almost. We in Pacifica? What's this building? Old hotel, the Pistis Sophia, where her sole guest is right now. Wanted to show you something. Come on. Why? Why bring me here, of all places? Give me a minute. You'll see. You took over. Couldn't just leave you there, could I? I don't gonna say that. Did you want to pop the pill? Cooler chrome. If I'd wanted full control, I'd have taken it already. Lots earlier. Up. Derailed your plan in the nick of time. And I think fear of death's got you spewing misdirected anger. Hmm. Huh. I like that line. Climb through the window. Can manage that. I think. You wanted to know why I brought you here. There's a hidey hole where I'm standing. Open it. Empty it. Is yours? They were. Belong to you now. Why are you giving me these? Imagine we're deployed together, fighting in a war, side by side. Would you take a bullet for me? I... I don't know. Answer me. Dumb ass question. Yes or no? <sighs> I would. Yeah. Tags belong to a man who sacrificed his life for mine in Mexico. I was gonna say no. Been thinking about our predicament. Want to be clear. I will do you no wrong. When the time comes, it'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get white. Tags are proof of my promise. Kind gesture, I guess, but... You can't really give me something I already have. Body's mine. Always has been. It is my decision. Not Let's not intruders. talk on it anymore for now, okay? You seriously considering Hanako's offer? Got a better idea. Not yet, but I got a request. Well? Adam Smasher, fucker who got the better of me. Whatever happens to me, I want him zero, gone, tossed into the wind as mulch. Right. Understood. And I want Rogue to be there with you. It's important to me, and it's just as important for her. So I gotta tell Rogue everything? Think I'd better do that. Handle it personally. You'll drop the pills from Misty. 
and I'll steer the ship for a bit. Not at all excited about this plan. Realize that, right? Just gonna have a quick chat with Rogue about Smasher. Then I'm out, I promise. Need to know exactly what you plan to do. I'll tell Rogue the truth. See if she's willing to help. Hey, just busted out of Soul Prison. Check out my new ass. All I gotta do is mention Smasher. Serve him up on a platter. Muse over the old days. Easy. Fine. I'll do this for you. Appreciate it, thanks. Take me to the afterlife. Promise, you won't regret this. Feeling better. Should get going. Still feel a sharp something near your heart. Doubt that's ever going away. <laughs> the Hotel Pista Sofia. That right? Mm-hmm. Good place to die. Just not today. Act three. Um, okay. That's not what I... So... We'll do this. Huh. Yeah, okay, never mind. We're gonna do this because if I'm gonna go against Adam Smasher, I need to get some better weapons, um, which I'll probably do off camera just so I can have, like to read through them. Is this the right way down? I'm gonna say that it is, yes, yes, yes. I, I mean, so, is there like no trash collection anymore? Just like nothing? Like everywhere except for where it's rich, rich, rich is disgusting. In terms of uncleanly, like in the public street. Um, I guess not. Where's the thing? One second, y'all. I'll be right back. All right. Um, we need to find a fast travel point. So let's just, I know. Oh, right there. Um, okay, so back to the questions about law school. So things that I wish that I knew sooner. Um, I wish I figured out how I best learn sooner. This was something that I struggled with in undergrad a lot. Um, and basically what I mean is just how oh two things one how i best learn and two how to take law school tests more efficiently i am not good when it comes to multiple choice questions so i'm going to use this summer to really work on that okay we'll go to this one i'm going to use this summer to work on it um and just overall improve my analytical thinking and how i'm going to do that is through language i am learning french i took spanish for like eight years of my life so i'm going to move on to french i'm not fluent in spanish i'm actually too afraid to talk but i know how to read and how to write and i can talk if necessary i just be scared so i just don't do it and we're going to run so that i can use this time to talk to y'all um but yeah so i wish that i had just knew how to do better with multiple choice questions and how I best learn and consume information. I actually did do a good job of that last summer going into my first year because now I'm going into my second. Um, and I learned that I, I figured out that I learned best through repetition. Um, so I would just like, I use Quimby and Barbary. So I would just listen to Quimby videos because they're short. Um, like uh every other day depending like yeah so just the more that i heard that or at least once a week so the more that i heard the information the better it stuck in my brain then by the time finals come i wasn't panicking i also kept up with my outline so that helped as well but i figured i learned best through repetition but now i want to improve my how i do multiple choice questions and i want to do that outside of just practice through um, learning a language to help with my analytical thinking. So, 
that is that on that now my bad and it says how you adapted to the classes um i feel as though i adapted to the class as well i knew how law school worked before oh i could have took that one i knew how law school worked before going there in terms of i had a general gist point of no return what okay y'all i had to google it because i got to this part pretty fast so we not going to do this we gonna go do the other missions first because if we do this now we'll only get one ending but if we do the other stuff first we'll get all the other endings i'm gonna do uh, uh we're gonna go <laughs> we're gonna go visit pan am um yeah yeah i wasn't expecting that at all i wasn't expecting that so um why do i feel like my first time playing this game was way more chaotic <laughs> like, it, it was way more chaotic i just did things i did a lot of side missions whereas here i'm not Anyway, so adapting to the classes for me was fine. Um, I just did what the professor said. So I just briefed all of the cases. I used Quimby to help me understand the topics that we were learning that day. Um, like in criminal law, if we were talking about uh, omissions, then I would just use Quimby to discuss to learn about omissions or robbery or stuff like that. So adaption was fine. I just did what was asked of me. Hey y'all. So it's been some hours later. I took a nap and I feel very much more cognizant to be able to play this game. And that first part, I was so sleep deprived that that's why when the part was like the point of no return, I was so confused. But I'll be quick. You can skip this if you want. Another reason I was confused is because when I played this game the first time, I did things in a different order. Um, I also never finished the game because it was glitching so bad, but that part, even though I finished more than half of the game, never popped up to me, for me. So just the way that I did things just got us, just unlocked the end of the game a lot faster. But I'm awake now. <laughs> oh, I hope the first part of this video was good. I don't think it's bad, but it's just like, did my actions make sense? Also, I like how this is different now, the home screen. So their beef in all Damn we said was, hell, we don't know what we're doing. Are you seriously considering letting that basilisk slip through our fingers? I am. But a chance like this. A chance at what? Rotting up the job we came here to do? We're pissing Militech off, so they hammer us into the dirt right here. Shit, Pan Am, can you please tell him? I've already Oh, tried. I didn't turn on my light. Let it go, Mitch. The Biotechnica people will be here in an hour. Try Yay. not to cock anything else up before then. Ooh. I can't believe it. Look, there he goes, off to paint the grass green. I thought the Biotechnica contract had withered and died. Saul insists we see it through to the end. To prove the Aldecaldos keep their word. Crop protection? Who gives a damn about crop protection? All Saul is going to prove is that a corp can walk all over us, and we'll say thank you and ask for more. What's this basilisk nonsense? It's an armored Militech cargo panzer junk from back in 2060 or so they want to pedal it off to a backwards country somewhere it can still pass as a technological wonder the Militech convoy will take the 101 right past us shame not to say hello this basilisk worth another fight with Saul yes a craft like that would finally put us back on the right path the family is falling apart if we fall into this biotechnica rut no one will ever take us seriously again Okay, so you do want to go behind Saul's back. Drag me here specifically for that. Cassidy, Ted, Carol, and Bob also on board. And you plan to grab the Basilisk, how? Thanks, V. Haven't said I'd help just yet. Okay, let's go talk to the rest. <clears throat> I want to upgrade my weapons. Uh, we got to get our money up. I know we had our money up and I gave the money to v to Victor. Um, I just wanted to. So, just the four vets on board with the plan. Nobody else. We didn't bother asking the others. There was too great a risk someone would take it to Saul. Besides, only the vets understand what we have to gain by having a basilisk. Sounds pretty risky to me. On the contrary, easy as pie. There won't even be much security on the convoy. Plus, We'll be doing our part towards furthering the cause of world peace. 
Why should this beast wind up being used in some little third world skirmish? We'll make better use of it right here in America. Okay, so I got my question you answered as to what continent we were on. No luck, huh? No. Okay, everyone listen. Militech will transport the basilisk in parts distributed across two trucks. Wait, do I sense a quiver in your voice? Fuck you! The convoy will halt at the railroad crossing on the 101. We'll attack from behind, <coughs> then get the hell out and away. Questions? Comments? Motions? Nice job, sunshine. Okay, I'm in. Hmm, okay. Thanks. First, we'll ride to the station. The train engine we need to block the convoy's way is there. Are you riding with us, or will we meet you there? Riding with you. Excellent. Let's get going. Yeah, I know you can meet them near to like whatever, but I don't I I see the purpose in it. That voice. You did not. Ah, uh, come on. Did you get your hands clammy? Screw you. But are you sure you didn't leave any tracks? Militech won't notice a thing. Are you trying to insult me, Bobby? Okay, okay. Forget I even asked. Telling you, man, having a nice nap does wonders. Cause I was so tired, I was so frustrated. That's why I was just confused. A little quick nap, quick, quick, quick. Get you right done. Also, I'm in my pajamas. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> but um, you know, I was thinking. <clears throat> Nobody's gonna notice you gone back at camp. Saul has no wish to see us there anyway. It's a better to make a good second impression on the biotechnica suits. Your sour faces wouldn't help much. Indeed, they would not. I was thinking, and then I'll skip the ride. One th okay, this is gonna be talking. One thing I would love right. is to do like gaming a after dark, uh, like on Twitch, and just stream some games that I've always wanted to play. Um, I know I could do it here on the channel, but just like less formal. Like it so or some games I haven't played in years. The train. Let the basilisk go on its way. Yeah. Then just drive this beast to the 101. Bear him back. Saul would be on board with that. Are we ready? Okay. The Militech convoy will be traveling from Night City to the base where they're due to meet the buyer. We will stop it at the railroad crossing. All we have to do is shove this beauty in its way. All we have to do. V, any questions? Plan to move this thing how exactly? It's old tech. Carol will have to hack it. Then I'll somehow have to finagle authorization from the control tower to move it. Tower looks inactive to me, too. Yeah, we'll see to that. You and Pan Am just get the authorization code. Okay, let's get to work. Hmm. But yeah, that's something I like to do. Um... <clears throat> Oh, my cat is awake. Huh, that was quick. Yeah, girl. Got that technical ability. Made things a lot easier. Oh, Euro dollars. Hey. Now we have 3077. The stairs it is, then. Oh, yeah, I still got a uh, loot more. I know we had some missions where... I could have been looting a lot more. But you know, when somebody is kind of wanting to take you out the game, looting is usually the last thing on my mind. I've always been fond of trains and the stations where so many tracks converge. Hmm. Junctions. Yes, those. When you see them from above, you feel free. Like you could set off on a thousand journeys all at once. Perhaps more simply, hopeful. Yo, something else I just thought of, right? Are there children in Night City? Like, do they go to okay, school? Here we are. Because I don't remember seeing any children. All I see are adults. Unless Girl, I do and they I don't recognize it. What cards? Would you help me look? Sure thing. 
Not here. Bro, that's crazy. So they have absolutely no idea what a CD is. Not here. They probably don't even know what a USB drive is. Nothing here. Okay, it must be here somewhere. Hey, look thorough, Nothing here. Please. Oh, grenade upgrade. Per. So I just know if I said VHS tape, they'd be like, what are you talking Nothing about? Nothing here. Drop. Okay. Yeah, that's wild. That's wild. Hmm. Oh, well, well. Yes! Thank you, game. You heard me say I was broke and you have given me money. Got something. Good job. Carol! We have a card! What now? You have to put it in the reader! Are you talking about... The card in the reader. Every time I hear the name Kara, I just think of The Walking Dead. Which I haven't. Goes Jesus. I'm like seasons behind. I watched a good bit of it. It worked. Come look. Little engine that could. The. I wanted to speak with you. What's up? What do you want to talk about? I know this may sound foolish, because I asked you to help me. But... Why are you doing this? Because it's important to you. But is that all? I... Sorry, that sounded worse than I intended. Any more questions? No, I know everything I need to, I believe. Perhaps I should send Rogue flowers to thank her for introducing us. Mm, not really your style, don't think. I would add a card. Thank you for giving me a true friend, you manipulative whore. That's my girl. All right, let's rejoin the others. Mm. But yeah, y'all, if I did streaming, I would love to like, there's a whole bunch of games I want to play. Um, Ghost of Tsushima. What's that Convoy. new one that just came out with the it? girl? It's a yes. Carol checks their communication channels from time to time. Everything is proceeding as planned. It's like a JRPG. I don't know if that's how you would classify it. What is it called? It just came out, but it's like a girl, and you have a robot with you. Hmm. I can't think of the name of it, but I want to play that. Bunch of older games I want to play. I was watching, um. Yeah, we just going to it. Um. The, uh. I was watching CSI New York and they were talking about Gears of War. I've never played a Gears of War game before. Um. Maybe the list isn't that long. No, there is stuff that came out years ago that I wanted to play. It's just not coming to mind right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I would love to do that on Twitch. I just don't know how. I don't assume it's difficult, but I always see people have a stream deck and I don't understand the purpose of that. Down a minute, honey. And breathe. Every Things under control. The convoy is already heading our way. Cheers. You worried about Saul? You're acting spooked. As if you're the first person ever to stand up to Saul. Oh, save your breath. I don't need to be consoled. Ugh. Was it someone I know? New. Scorpion. 
You came home from the war, head full of new ideas and a host of new contexts. He tried to get Saul to lead us in joining Snake Nation. It would make us stronger, he said. I don't think he peeped a word of it to me. What did Saul do? Saul dressed the guy down head to toe for messing with the family. Hell, he didn't send him on any jobs for a year. Gee, really consoling. Thanks. You said yourself you didn't need any. Gonna try and get some sleep. Okay, it'll be quite some time before the convoy comes through. <laughs> Couldn't sleep if you tried, could you? I'll just lie here a while, by your side, gazing at the stars. That another area of your expertise? <clears throat> I don't see any. Got maps oh, of the heavens things? in your library, too? Of course. That's the Big Dipper. And do you see the small flickering star to the right? Yeah. You do? Oh, dear. That means there's a major leak. Good night, V. If y'all ever see me looking down, sometimes I'm writing down the names of what I'm gonna call these videos. Is everyone ready? So I don't forget. Let's ride, V. Wow, look at Pan Am going 75 miles an hour. Last time I was in a car, she was doing a smooth like 30, I think. They're going faster than we thought. I don't know if we can catch them. Uncouple one of the cars, it'll speed you up. Wait, no coming in hauling. Take out that couple. All right, let's go. All right, y'all, we getting it, we getting it, we getting it. Sweet. This isn't real. This weapon isn't real. This weapon isn't real. No way it should take that long. Just give me another one. Oh my sweet. Why am I not firing? What's in the absolute? Mitch, Bob, go! All 
All is planned, boss. All right, the train's leaving. You'd better move. Where did this where where did this shotgun come from? Okay, let's go. Did I do this earlier? Oh, I didn't collect stuff. He has something that's purple. It's okay. I feel like we should expect. Fuck! It worked! Ooh, that's a nice car. I don't know. Seemed a little too easy for this game. Always expect enemy fire. How's it going there, V? Did you have fun? Sure did. Just be happy you won't be around to put the hunger junk together. The real fun is just starting with Mitch and Teddy. Hmm. Que pasó? Hmm. All right, I guess. Also, yo. Um. Okay. Just lost the Militech channel. The suits finally realized someone was listening and changed the codes. Perfect timing, if you ask me. Carol and Judy sound like the same. Like, I'm about the same, but they sound very similar. I guess that makes sense, but just in terms of dialect. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think. So yeah, so after dark, um, I do want to play another game side by side this, but I want to start playing some like, uh, indie games that are just on Steam. So if you guys have any recommendations for Steam games that I could play, preferably some that are free, but if it's not free, cheap. <laughs> um, I'll take care of this myself. But that would be preferred. Um. That I can play. If it's a horror game, uh, please don't make it too scary. I enjoy sleeping at night. Fuck, Pan Am. So it begins. Oh, I thought I had to walk to him. What's the meaning of this? Exactly what you see, the basilisk. All I see is two trucks with giant Militech logos on them. Fuck, Pan Am! You can see them from miles away! You think we don't have problems enough on our hands? The Raffins could rear their heads at any moment! And now we have Militech to worry about, too! Stop it! Fuck! Just shut up already! Do you want to serve corporations forever? Fine! Go right ahead! In that case, we'll leave the Basilisk as a souvenir of what this family used to be! Or you know what? Maybe next time we're attacked, we'll be able to fight back! As soon as I'm done with Biotechnica, we call a family meeting to discuss this. Discuss you. Until that time, I want these trucks out of my sight. And the Basilisk? Can we put it together? Do what you want. Just get out of my sight. Bob, Mitch, you two take the trucks around back. We need to unload. Sure, but then what do we do with them? Oh, I've got an idea. Got quite a pair of lungs there. Thanks. I believe the last time I pulled something like that, I was 10 years old. Seems still to be in fine working order. You need me again. All you gotta do is call. V. I am sure I will. So you better expect that call. Be waiting. Take care. Alright, y'all. Um, so we have a little bit of money. I actually don't think that's true. I think I made that up. But let's see. We have 3,740. Let's just see if we can sell. Leave the. Oh. Si? Hello? Hi. We're gonna see what you got in stock. Only the baddest firearms in We're... all the bad lands. Isn't that why you're back? We're not gonna do that Hanako sama mission until everything else is done. All right, y'all. So I was talking about reload speed before, right? We can't afford nothing, but we can sell some stuff. Because you'll be 
the one that I like a lot, my hair is making, um, has an attack speed of, okay, damage 20. See, the reload speed is 1.8. So you want a higher reload speed, right? What do we have? This can go. I do not like, actually, it's not that bad. It's just the reload speed is awful. Sure, I'll sell it. Um, We have two shotgun. We have two of the exact same weapon. Okay. Ugh. And then we have... We'll sell this one because I don't even use half of these weapons. So in my opinion, having them is quite useless. Um, we'll keep overwatch. Where did I get this from? We can, we can sell it. I don't, I don't use these weapons, guys. <laughs> so we have... We'll keep the Ashura. It just gets on my nerves. We'll keep a pistol. Kayubi. Hmm. Can you upgrade weapons in this game? I don't think so. Hmm. And the revolver. We'll get rid of this too. I don't use these weapons. I need to find stuff that's better. I need to do some research. Um, all right. We'll keep this for now, I suppose. We'll keep the Widowmaker. We'll keep Overwatch. We'll keep Kayubi. All right. Now we have $12,212. Oh yeah, we still can't afford a thing. How much? Oh, this is all the stuff I just... 30,000? Chill. Lord. All right. And then we can upgrade ourselves. We have a perk point. Let's see. Recovery. Oh, no, no, no. Let's see what we can do for body. Body, yaddy, yaddy. Okay. Don't stop me now, only affect shotguns. When do we unlock this part? Fifteen? Oh, okay. Um, okay. Ten percent health regen for every nearby enemy. Only affects no movement penalty with shotguns. Yeah, let's do that. All right. Leave the camp and wait until the bask list is ready. Okay, so in the meantime, what we'll do is, cause we're not gonna do this until like literally the very end, since that is considered the last mission of the game. I know you can do it and then go back to what you're doing before, but it just makes sense to me to just wait until the end. So we're going to go to the afterlife instead. And if we, uh, where's the thing at? If we get to the afterlife, where's the little fast travel thingy? Oh, it's over here. But yeah, cause that was just, wow. Stuff in this game is so far, but I really like it. I, I really love games that are set up just like this one, where it's a completely open world. I know I said this before, but I just love it. I love true open world games and not games that feel like they're open world, but then they have the invisible walls when you try to go someplace. Um, so I love that this one is a true open world game. And then of course, overall fashion, I'm gonna get lost. Because I'll be getting lost. Alright, let's go pretend to be Johnny. Welcome back. Hi. 
So, ready? Yes, I what? Rogue should be here any minute. Wow. Ready as I'll ever be. Okay. I'm ready. About fucking time. Look a little different. Fuss with your hair or. It's good to be back. Never knew you'd gone off somewhere. What's your poise? Because on the outside we look like V. Tequila old fashioned. Top it up with beer and sprinkle in some chili. Silverhand special. Been a while since anyone ordered that. What? Tequila, beer, and chili? What type of beer? Cause that just sounds... I guess, don't knock it till you try it. I don't intend on trying it. But like, that just is a little wild. No water. Cassius Ryder. Name mean anything to you? Mm hmm. Tattoo guy. How do you know the name? We go back. Where'll I find him? Got a salon in Watson, Pershing Street. Oh. So what'll it be? Billy Goat or the other one? Billy Goat? Other one. She's gonna love it. <laughs> sure she will. This is Wook. Yo. Jeremiah Grayson. Heard he's an operator for Smasher. But you didn't hear that from me. Bro, this is how they do tattoos now? Again? Yeah. Could say we had something in common. <laughs> Ruby Collins. Sloppy second for Grayson. After I banged her. Jeez. What the? Hey, drink slinger. This is just wow because on the inside we're Johnny, but on the outside we're us. So it's like we look like V. I like being Johnny because it's just so different. And uh, it's a wild ride every time we play as Johnny. <laughs> she got on the Good Burger hat. Left because I'm left handed. I think I got something back. Hey, you Ruby? What? You've heard about me? Let's get out of here. Tell you what I heard. Then you'll show me if I'm right. Just got a little biz to take care of first. Oh, <laughs> right after he was. Ugh. And no flushing in between? Oh goodness. Yo! Get your fucking paws off Ruby! She ain't going anywhere with you. She's on that clock, got it? So are you guys. Get back to work. I'm a crushed up bitch! Be waiting outside! You waiting for me? Let's go back to my place. Where to? 
to? Martin Street. I'll take the long way. Look good on you. Got a light? I don't think I can say what I what I'm thinking on the internet. But, oh! Oh my God! I'll call. I'll call. Ruby, focus. I need to talk to Grayson. Hello, Night City. Talk about something else, please. Sure. First time you walked up, since there was something familiar about you. Blah, blah, Johnny told you. Don't seem surprised. Was surprised, but not anymore. You probably don't remember. Got flashes here and there. Not everything. Thank God. He called me early morning. Of course, I thought it was you. And I thought, cute kid. Too bad she's gone completely whacked. <sighs> Came to see for yourself, huh? Morbid curiosity. Mm-hmm. And I found Johnny Silverhand. That feels weird, this. You knowing about Johnny? Face is changing, you know. Still look like V, but that mean smirk, I'd know it anywhere. Oh! How he talks, moves, how he smokes. I don't smoke. I know. Could never confuse you two. So sleep soundly. Smasher, he tell you about him? Yes. Didn't know he'd come back to NC. Johnny found some way to get at him. Wait, Grayson? Jeremiah Grayson. Works for Smasher. Johnny got a tip off some stripper, don't ask me how. Ebonike. Just that. Still, let me see what I can do. We're gonna get that son of a bitch. Know what Smasher's been up to all this time? Disappeared after the Sokka Tower assault in 2023. All thought he was gone for good. Then suddenly reappeared. Did a few Mondo jobs for Arasaka, then went right back to ground. Nobody's seen him in years. Except Grayson, apparently. Can I help at all? In your state? <laughs> You're useless. Almost. Follow Buzz you when I learn something. Okay. Unbelievable that bastard somewhere in your head. You tricked me. 
just supposed to talk to Rogue. Did talk to her. <sighs> the stripper. Empathy brawl. Tattoo. All required, man. Had to give Rogue something real, didn't I? Ebunike? A lead on Grayson, supposed to be a lead on Smasher? Lead to lead? That's real? Real enough for Rogue. Quit mumble whining and let's Delta. B, the Basilisk. It's ready. Would you like to drive it? Yeah. Sure. The hell is this place? Fuck me. Place it where is you can awesome. puke all over the car. So no I hear. problem. Beggar, not chooser. Cool. I don't see the purpose in this. You probably won't answer. It. So, feeling better? No. All right. Yeah, that's kind of wild. First of all, first of all, I think the most thing that is blasphemy is how they do tattoos. Like, is that supposed to make it? what <laughs> more like what precision because if your artist is talented then precision isn't a problem that's wild that they don't have someone actually there with the needle doing it i don't think i could do that i'd be like mm -mm. i didn't get the real experience pain and all just a little more time yeah. all ready to go hey v no not yet Carol still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the systems. Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss? No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the wrapping can. Which was almost as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. Hmm. Fuck, made it look like it just came back from a Corpo war tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. Always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which is exactly how all those naive gonks landed at the front. Didn't even need to be recruited. They just showed you the tech. Go on, hop in. Everything is set. Bet. How do I... Oh. Oh, hey, girl. You here, too? Oh, she took a jacket off. Must be warm today. All right. Let's fire her up. Hold on to your head. You know, I really hope that, um, there is another... I don't know if there can be... Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything gotta... is dandy. Give me a moment. I don't think I don't know if there could be a cyberpunk too. But I do hope that um you know Project Red makes this company, right? Project Red oh, yes! makes a game, another game like this. It's not the latest model, but Mitch and Bob did what they could. What do you think? Well, at least now I know why people call them coffins. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What, no knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, none. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. It's like a mystical oneness. Well, if it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support? I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. Okay, I'm not doing okay. anything. If you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. It's oddly pleasant. You'll see. 
What is that? And nobody sees this? Okay. This will do fine. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. Doesn't need two pilots? You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Pan Am? Is this, uh, as designed? Neural synchronization doesn't happen at the snap of one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There. See? Oh, okay. Okay. Starting to understand what you meant. Warm up. Don't worry. I'm not gonna watch. Accelerate. Decelerate. Okay. Soft ride. Seems a boat. She'll fly right over any bumps. All types of terrain. Okay. Get towards that wreck. This is nice. All right. I can see you've grown bored. Now take her along the line of turbines. When I say so, swerve right or left before the last of them. All right. Engines offline. Oh, online, online. Okay. Left. Very good. Keep her going. Okay, this is cool. Right. Woo. Yes, that's the way to do it. Bet. We gotta back up. Back, back, back it up. What's on the menu? Don't get excited. The Basilisk is a cargo ship by design. But it should still be a good time. All right, blast those wrecks. Press R2. Oh. Good. Wow. So like does this I mean do we have like the ammo? Okay. Practice is over. Oh. Good. Now I'm going to connect. It could feel strange. Meaning basilisk pilots have to be fully oh. synchronized. That means our nervous systems will be linked. Oh Jesus. Okay. It's as if you booked a room with two beds but got a double bed with a blanket wide enough for half. Okay, let's try this. This will get to know you better than I'd planned. All right. Let me just say, it can be difficult at first. You'll experience feedback, sensory echoes as our systems overlap. Probably comes naturally in combat. Mm-hmm. Right. Starting now. What in the world? Oh! They found us. We have to get back to camp. Oh, 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 oh! Yo, this is lit. Okay, yo, let's go. We have to help the family. Go, go, go. Where are you at? We're almost there. Okay, I see Pan is. Those bastards are in for a surprise. Okay, V. Let's get to work. Yeah. Yeah. Just when I think I'm out, they pull me back in. But say hello to my little friend. Yes, I know those are two separate movies. It just works. Just go with it. Yeah. Everything. Yes, you turned them to dust. Congratulations. It's time to talk. Oh, 
All I need in this life is sin. Is me and my Berskalis. Or Baskalis. I forgot what it's called. All of us. Each on his or her own. Must think first and foremost. Why'd she put a jacket back on? Come on, Salt. If I have to leave the clan, please just say so. Spare me another speech of yours at the very least. I'm afraid you'll have to sit through a few more. Because from this day forward, you will lead this family by my side. I will what? I wish to do this properly, but fine. Have it your way. I was wrong. You were right. That's the truth. May it never happen again. But I, I, I made a mess of so many things. You said... I know. But I changed my mind. You risked everything for this family, not even knowing whether you'd be welcome the next day. Okay. Okay. Well, I... Many things will have to change. Yes. And to start with, we need to leave this place. Quickly. We can't wait for Militech to find us. Of course. I will prepare our route. All right. Congratulations. Terrible choice. I voted nay. Thank you. Thanks. I need to cool down, I think. Will you come with me? No, I voted nay. That's hilarious. Oh, that's awesome. One thing I like about this growth to this game is that it actually progresses in the story. Um, I, one of my An favorite things interesting day. is character development. I feel as if I barely evaded a rapidly approaching train. It's pretty close. I don't know if I could have done it without you. <laughs> Come on. Shit. Did no, you I'm see serious. the Basilisk in action? We all owe you. It blasted them into So you can count on me uh. to count us. No squirming. Always. Lie still. I need to examine you. Good to know. They dare show their faces again. How many did we drop? Our lord. Hmm. Nobody's behind the bar. They could have been that I like. That basilisk could come around sooner. Pan Am missing from camp at such a critical moment. You'll have some explaining to do. What is Beer? She? Lemonade? Oh, I love lemonade. Are you about done? Who's watching this? It's not letting me. I cut on the. Let me walk down and come back up. <laughs> Okay, I just set myself on fire. It's not letting me do anything, y'all. Do I need to... Oh my gosh. I might have to restart this. Okay, there we go. I didn't see this the first. Oh my gosh, because I wasn't supposed to hop over the thing. Okay, Jesus Christ. Suit yourself. I love lemonade. To happy endings. Gonna miss our little escapades. Me too. On the other hand, though, who said this one was our last? V, look around. Look at them. They could be your family. Panem, what do you... Stay in camp. Join us. I'd love to, Panem. I really would. Mm-hmm. Here comes that damned butt. I can't. Not right now. Have to finish some things first. All right, V. I shouldn't drop bombs like that on you right now. I just thought, uh, forget about it. I'll think it over. At Period. You saw how she came to help us? Mm-hmm. I like that.
V. Pan Am. I... V, relax. Everything is okay. How do you feel? Like I have an engram in my head? What happened? I remember I... We were talking, and then suddenly... You passed out. Completely. We took you with us. Where? Somewhere new. We moved camp. Don't worry, we are safe here. For now. You ain't dying yet. V, you have to tell me what is happening. The blood. You were out for hours. What's wrong? Pan Am, I... It's getting worse. Every single day. Okay, V, relax. Take it bit by bit. What is happening exactly? I have an engram. You know Johnny Silverhand? Yes, they sometimes play those oldies on the radio. Why? That's just it. Oldies? Johnny's alive. He's sitting in my head. He's what? Am, am I not? Is this some sort of strange metaphor? <sighs> Long story. Got a job, fucked it up. Now Silverhand's personality construct's sitting in my head. Bullshit. Yeah, well, he's not too happy about it either. Turns out we don't really mix. And it's getting worse. You are not joking. Just trying to live with it. Survive, actually. It's certainly not doing wonders for your health. I gotta go. Feeling better. Really. Wait. I will go with you. I thought I heard that voice. Hey, Mitch. Finally. We were worried. Took good care of your ride. She's over there. But you're not leaving us already, are you? Is everything okay? Yeah. Thanks. I'll stick around for a bit. Make yourself at home. Remember, our offer still stands. Aww. If you need help, the Aldecaldos are here for you. And that, Thanks. at least, we can agree on. If you need anything... You know where to find us. Thanks. That's so nice. I really do. I, <clears throat> I really do love the sense of family in this game, despite all of the uncivilness. Yes. Despite the law, the lawlessness that is in this game, they really do have a strong sense of family, at least within the nomads. Um, I know this area, and I truly love Back it. From the old roots. You're really safe here, though. For now, yes. Militech does not venture this far. And our vantage points really are hey, much better. Welcome back to the land of the living. About time Sleeping Beauty decided to join us. Thank you. Hey there. Hi. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. You know, I don't know. Let me know what y'all think. I kind of think. But you know, everything here. Okay. My camera's going to cut off. All of it. We will soon have to decide what comes soon. next. Personality wise, I don't think V and Johnny. V, back to what we were saying. I will not even pretend to understand. I don't think it has even sunk in yet. But I am serious. How can I help? Honestly, not a clue. But there has to be something. Someone who can... Remember Hellman? She's the one who created the personality construct tech. That's why you wanted to get him. But it was a dead end. Now I have to figure out where to go next. You'll find a way. And once you do, let me know. I will help. This whole family will help. Saul was not joking. You understand? Thanks, Pena. Can we hug? No. Okay. All right, y'all. Bye, friend. Now. Oh, we leveled up. Okay, let's level up body. 
Um, what can we do for cool? 20% mitigation chance. Oh, yeah, I like that. All right. Wait a day for Ro to call. All right, then we'll just wait for that. So, uh, yeah. So I'm gonna just restart the recording and come back. But I wanted to say personality wise, I don't think Johnny and V are that much of a difference. She, for me, and I would like to hear y'all opinion. If you disagree with me, that's fine. Um, I kind of feel like she's a calmer version of him, but morally and values, they disagree with their approach. I think Johnny's motivation for all that he did was because of alt, um, and but I don't agree with everything that he did. But I think their morals and values are different. But personality wise, I I don't know. But maybe it's just because I'm used to him being in her head and stuff like that. But let me know what y'all think when we come back. We're just going to fast forward time and wait for Alt to come back, and then we'll talk about the whole scene with Johnny. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching and stay hydrated. <laughs>